Hello and welcome to the bonus stage 3 guide with Silver Death, Hard Mode and Spirit Orbs if it procs. In the description below I put a video from Iron, his name is Gera in Discord, with a perfect run uninterrupted, because I'm gonna use clips, alright? It's gonna be fast as usual, but you can always rewind. Saws appear only in parts 1 and 2, Orbs appear in parts 1, 3 and 4. You're gonna do a big jump and then small jumps. And here a big jump, you cannot fall because there's saws there. And here is the toughest, you're gonna do a big jump from the ledge and then a wall jump. And if you get the orb, that's fine. Or sometimes you're gonna get over the orb and don't worry about it, there's plenty of them in parts three and four. And watch this again if you need to. Small jump from the edge and you're gonna fall right on the platform. There's no saws here, but with or without saws, it's the same jump. Part 2 with saws is the same thing as in episode 51, which is the basic guy that I made on hard mode with nothing. And you just have to not fall too low and not touch the saws. It's not too bad in the sense that it's still difficult, but it's not much tougher than the original run without silver death. I'll refer you to that episode once again, it's in the exclamation mark on top right. Parts 3 and 4 with orbs is actually easier than the original one. You get so much speed here, you're just gonna touch the wall and do a small jump. I'm gonna show you where, right there. Touch the wall and do a small jump and it's very very fast and natural. And it's honestly pretty easy. It's really the two first parts that are difficult in my opinion. And then part 4, check it out, nothing too complicated, you're gonna hug the wall every time for half a second or something like that. Hug the wall, small jump. You see how I touch the wall every time and I do a small jump, that's all you gotta do. And you have way more time because you're going so fast due to the orbs that this is actually easier than the original one. If you play with saws and orbs don't proc, here's an extract from episode 51. And in part 3, I'll show you two approaches. First approach is this, and it's risky, so you jump from the top, or you can fall and jump on a little ledge like this. But this is easy, even if you fall on hard mode here, it's really not difficult. It's the easiest part. And then part 4, I decided to stop being fancy and stick with the approach I had in episode 50. You're gonna do a small jump and I do a big jump before the ledge here. Some people jump on it, but I tried doing it and it caused me problems. Why do this if whatever I'm doing is working already? Big jump here and here a small jump. Big jump, big jump, small jump here. And that's it. And I'll have enough time. Look at this. I have two seconds and look at all these orbs. I'm guaranteed to make it. No problem. I never failed using this method. And yeah, bonus stage 2 is easier, you cannot switch until you ultra ascend, so you better be sure that you wanna do this. Regarding my last comment about reverting back to bonus stage 2 through ultra ascension, this might already be changed by the time you watch this, so you can ignore that if a new divinity or something was added. I did my best to explain this, I still have trouble with it, I'll be honest with you. Is that wall jump in part 1 that kills me. Anyways, I hope this helped. Let me know in the comments if you have questions or anything like that. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel. Still playing the game and episode 52 is in the works. See you around.